A satire about race and show business opens next month on Broadway. The play Yellowface examines a history of how Hollywood overlooked Asian American actors. Dave Carlin covers art and culture, and he sat down with the play star, Daniel Day Kim. This industry defines us by how we appear. Yellow face refers to non-Asian actors playing Asian characters as a form of erasure. A topic tackled by a play opening on Broadway starring Daniel Day Kim. There's a line in the play that says, you know, throughout history, Asians have been caricature caricatured and even often and denied the right to play ourselves. The star of TV's Lost and Hawaii Five O last appeared on Broadway in The King and I in 2016. Because I have a platform, I have an ability to, to affect some change. And um, I'd like to see us make those changes. There's a lot in there. And you're unpacking it all in rehearsal. It's been really a joyful rehearsal experience. I love comedy, uh, and so it's nice to get the chance. Much of the comedy in Yellowface comes from a plot twist, a mistake made during the casting of a show within this show. I'm said white dude <laughs> who ends up uh, uh, being cast as, as an Asian guy. And then we just go down the rabbit hole of, of, of this mix-up and identity and the self and the masks that we wear. Playwright David Henry Wong begins Yellowface in the early 90s. 1990s with a real life controversy. The protests against the casting of Jonathan Price as the uh, Eurasian character, the engineer in the original production of Miss Saigon, which I was a part of, and it was a cultural kind of early culture war incident. The star says Yellowface and the character he gets to play in it represents an evolution in his acting career. So much of what I've done in the past is straight drama. So to be able to do a comedy, something that's lighthearted, and to talk about very serious issues, sometimes very scary issues, but address them from a very individual human point of view is, is, is liberating. So he said, sign me up for this production where identity and culture collide. In the theater district, Dave Carlin, CBS News, New York. Previews for Yellowface begin September 13th at Broadway's Todd Hames Theater.